few days away as well from Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And One Triad Survivor is now offering to help others who have beat this disease and may now be struggling to find their new normal. Here with us now is Dara Kurtz. She is an author and breast cancer survivor. And beginning next month, she will be leading a free five virtual program for cancer survivors. This is all through a partnership with Wake Forest Baptist Atrium Health Hospital. It is so great to have you, Dara. So we know this is called Learn to Thrive. I love that name. Please share some of your personal journey with our viewers. Thank you so much for having me. It's been almost eight and a half years since I heard those terrifying words, you have cancer. And at the time I was 42, my kids were 11 and 14, and it really came out of nowhere. One day I was fine, and then the next day I was hearing words like surgery, chemo, radiation. And it's a terrifying experience for anyone who has ever heard the words, you have cancer. And so many families go through that every single year, either losing a loved one or at least experiencing going through their journey with them. So Dara, how have you used your personal experience to sort of build up this online community to help others who are going along the same journey? After I went through all of the treatments and it was a really, really hard time for me and my family, I got to this point and the doctor said, okay, Dara, you're done. It's time to go back to the business of living your life. And I didn't know how to live my life because I had changed so much and fear followed me around like my shadow. And I realized, okay, I could stay in this space or I could do something about it. And so I started doing just a lot of work on myself. I um, read everything I could get my hands on, really focused on a lot of self-care, education, therapy, you know, all the things. And um, then after going through that and starting to speak and share my experience, I started talking all over really the country and realized that this is such a normal feeling that people go through a cancer diagnosis. And fortunately, we're so blessed thanks to modern medicine. Um, there are more survivors now than ever before, but people don't know what to do, how to transition from that, that space of being a cancer patient to living as a cancer survivor. And so that's when I started my community and really am so grateful to partner with Wake Forest Baptist Atrium Health to bring this free class to our community for people who find themselves in that space where they are done with treatment, but they don't know how to live as a cancer survivor. And, um, you know, I'm hoping and showing that people can thrive and really teaching people the tips and tools to help them on this next journey as they move and transition into that space. So Dara, it's, it's a five week program right? Totally mm -hmm. free, five weeks. Kind of how are you going to plan on walking, you know, these survivors? I like to call them thrivers too. So that's why I love your learn to thrive name for this course. How do you, if viewers at home are listening, they want to get involved. How do you hope that they kind of, you know, join you mm -hmm. and, and work yeah. alongside this course that you're leading? So this isn't the first session that we've had. Okay. We've the second one it's been unbelievable the feedback has been incredibly positive we meet virtually so everyone can meet from the comfort of their home which is amazing we had one person who even went through surgery and three days later was sitting in her bedroom with her laptop we meet virtually for five sessions we come together and what we're doing is we're building we're building a a sense of community we're bringing people together of course every cancer experience is different but a lot of the feelings are the same in terms of what people experience after going through a cancer diagnosis and what we've found and what we've seen is that when we bring people together who are at the same space and wanting to learn how to move forward, something beautiful really happens. Um, people show up, they're vulnerable, they share, they form this incredible supportive community and that's what we've seen happen. And I've seen it over and over again. Um, the first session is really thinking of yourself as, as a survivor. And then every week we'll talk about different things, the power of your mind, how to manage fear, how to live with intention, how to create joy, a lot of self-care things. Um, and of course, I give a little homework every week and show up via email and people can lean on me throughout the five weeks, ask me any questions. But 
it's been unbelievable and such a beautiful thing. And again, I'm so grateful that this is free to our community for anyone who has a loved one or finds themselves in the situation, please share with um, people because we want everyone to be able to take advantage of this five week free course. Wonderful to have you on our show, Dara. Thank you so much for your time. And we want to make sure folks at home know that the Thrive program begins October 12th. If you'd like to register, we will have this interview posted online later on triadcw.com. But in the meantime, be sure to follow Dara on Instagram. Her Instagram name is on your screen now to learn how to get involved and more opportunities of out course. there. We'll come